Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Laura, and today I'm doing Saturday shelfie tour. So uh, we are finished with the crates upstairs. So now we are in my library. I have three bookshelves in my library. So for today's video, I'm going to be working on the first shelf of my series shelf, which is right here behind me. And I'm going to pull out the books and share with you what's on them. And uh, mind you, these are stacked too. So I have books behind what you see here. So uh, stay tuned and I will share what's in there. And I'm going to put the books on the floor as I pull them out so I can see the back of the shelf. So here we go. Uh, the first book I have up here is a second book of a series. If I can even get it out of my bookshelf, I think I just broke a nail. Uh, anyway, uh, the first book I got is Murder of Crows by Anne Bishop. I read book one. I really enjoyed it. So now I have book two to read. <laughs> okay, so then I have The Princess in Spotlit by Meg Cabot. The Princess in Love by Meg Cabot. The Princess Diaries by Meg Cabot. I have not read Meg Cabot yet. <laughs> okay. Then I have the Soulless series, if I can get it down. <laughs> I have Soulless uh, by a gal Cal Carriger. I have now I've I don't know if what order these are in. Oh wait, did they say it on it? Oh, okay. Two is the Changeless. I have three, which is blameless. I have four, which is heartless. And I have five, which is timeless. So I have the whole series. I have not started yet. Okay, moving along, I have um, The Dog's Journey by W. Bruce Cameron. And I have The Dog's Purpose. So I have both books. I have not read them yet. Okay, I'm trying to make a pile so I can put it back on the shelf. <laughs> okay, so I have The Second Summer of Sisterhood uh, of Anne Brashers. I have book one and I think book three upstairs, so they're not together. Uh, but I have not read it yet, and it is going to be on my July. I'm hoping to read it with... Uh, a whole bunch of people in July. So that's this one. Okay, moving along, I have uh, The Graceling uh, by Kristen Ash. What is it? Gashore? It's hard to see. So that's that one. Have not read it yet. Okay, now I have the Claire, um, the Immortal Instruments series. I have City of Bones. I read this. Yay! <laughs> uh, City of Bones, I read. Finally, it took me over a year to read it. I really enjoyed it. I want to continue. Uh, so uh, hopefully my kids will read it. But I have this one and I read it. Okay, so then I have City of Glass. And I think I have City of Ashes upstairs to be read soon because that's what I'm on. But I have City of Glass. I have... City of Fallen Angels, I have Clockwork Angel, Clockwork Prince, Clockwork Princess, City of Lost Souls, City of Heavenly Fire, my god this is a fat book. <laughs> Uh, and then I have the Mortal Instruments Companion. I have the Bane Chronicles. I need to get the book. I have the audio book. So somehow I ordered this from Book Outlet by mistake. So that's that. Okay, moving on. <laughs> I have Once uh, by Anna Carey. Rise by Anna Carey. Pulse by Patrick Carmen. I have not read those. <laughs> okay, coming up to a book I read. Yay! Something Strange in Delhi. I really liked it. Um, I think I gave it four stars. Uh, I read this one. 
I have not read this one. The Darkness Strange and Lovely. Both by Susan Dennard. Okay, let's go. Now we're on the back shelf now. So we're going to go to the back. And this is going to be fun because I'm going to find books that I haven't seen in ages. <laughs> okay. I have The Mortal Danger uh, by Anne Aguirre. Dare Me by Megan Cat Abbott. 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 Sorry if I butcher anybody's names. And my pile is getting high and high. <laughs> okay, more about Meg Cabin. I have Vanished, which includes Safe House and San Sanctuary. And Vanished, uh, which includes When Lightning Strikes and Code Name Cass Cassandra. So I have both of them. Okay, more Meg Cabot. I have The Princess Present, Being Nikki, Airhead, and Perfect Princess. Now, I have not read those. And I think I had to make another pile because it's going to collapse. Oh, you wouldn't see this. Oh, it's going to fall. No, 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 don't fall. All right. Okay, so next I have... Now, I don't know what order these go in, but I think it's Glitch, Heather, Anastasi, I don't know. Glitch, Override, and Shutdown. So, I don't know what order they go in, but I have the three. So, yeah, so that's that. I'm going to make another pile on the floor. Okay. <laughs> I have uh, Moon Called by Patricia Bitt Briggs, and I've been looking for this book. So, yeah, I, I just found it. Yeah, it's in the back. <laughs> okay, so that's that. Then I have the beginnings, uh, Lux, Lux Beginnings, sorry, by Jennifer L. Armentrout. I got Consequences by Jennifer L. Armentrout and Opposition by Jennifer L. Armentrout. No, I have not read them yet, but I own them. Okay. Then I have. Uh, Everneath by Brody Ashton. The Rising by Kelly Armstrong. And The Summoning by Kelly Armstrong. No, I have not read them yet. Okay, moving along, I have one, two, three, four, five, six more books to go. And here we go. I have another Meg Cabot, Princess in Waiting. Then I have The Taken by Erin Bauman and The Frozen by Erin Bauman. So I have not read them yet. And Angels and Demons by Dan Brown and Infernal by Dane Brown, Dan Brown. No, I have not read them yet. And the last book that I have on the shelf. This is going to be fun trying to put them back. <laughs> I have A Born to Darkness by Suzanne Brockman. So that's the last book. So I hope you enjoyed this. So this is A, B, and C. And I think I have next shelf. Next week I will do the shelf that's D and over. So anyway, thank you for watching. If you have read any of these books, you tell me to read them like soon. I know I want to start reading The Mortal Instruments. I already started Bo City of Bones, so that will be re read soon. Uh, but let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching. Bye!